So yesterday Tesla posted this one minute video of their progress lately on Tesla bot and I immediately posted my reaction because I was so excited. And then this morning I'm scrolling Twitter and I see a bunch of posts from people saying that the video is fake. And they cited this moment where one of the blocks moves sideways and it's hard to see what exactly made it move. The people that make these kinds of accusations on Twitter are known as Tesla Q. They are a community who want to see the demise of Tesla. A lot of them have short positions against the stock and will benefit from Tesla failing. What I don't think that these people realize is that Tesla bot has no touch sensors in its hands. These blocks are ultra light, so even the slightest movement from the robot's hand is going to move these blocks. I've pulled out this clip as evidence of how easily these blocks move. But the video has 2.8 million views so far and it is growing rapidly. It's just amazing to me that there are people out there sitting in their mother's basements making accusations, just studying every little pixel of every video that Tesla posts, just trying to push their narrative further and further. I mean, why would Tesla be spending billions of dollars on compute if they were just gonna sit around making fake videos? Now, the reason that I'm actually making a fuss about this completely ignorant narrative is because Tesla might actually need to hire a PR department. Last night, I visited my father for dinner and him and my stepmom were going on about some portable house product that Tesla had unveiled. And they were so convinced that it was a real product because all these videos that they were seeing had millions of views. And I just went, no, that's not real. And they were like, well, how do you know? And I was like, trust me, if Tesla had a portable house product, I would know about it. And so they pull out their phone and they're like, well, what about this? And then my dad finds a video explaining how it's a big scam generating millions of views. There are all these accounts that make up fake news about Tesla and Elon all the time and people fall for it. It was somewhat difficult for even me my father's own son to convince him that these videos he was seeing were fake because he was so convinced they were real. So I think Tesla just needs a teeny tiny PR department who just has an official account on every platform that even just leaves a comment on some of these fake videos that they're not real. People are so quick to assume that just because a video has millions of views that it's true, but that's not always the case. Luckily, we have people like Dr. Jim Fan, the senior AI scientist at NVIDIA, and he writes that he is also seeing people talking about Optimus being CGI. That's actually the highest compliment you could possibly give to a robotics research team. I'm craving for one of my works to be labeled CGI. As I analyzed yesterday, what Optimus achieves is entirely within reach of today's AI technology. All it takes is robust hardware, good data collection pipeline, rapid iterative improvement on the model with rigorous evaluation, strong coordination of a team with diverse talents, from mechanical engineer to foundation model experts. So I guess what these naysayers are missing is that Tesla is working hard. So yeah, you can actually work hard. Not everything is fake. There are actually still people in the world who are working extremely hard to make the earth a clean place and actually ensure the survival of humanity. But I guess for some people, in this case, Tesla Q, maybe they'll just never understand that hard work still exists. But hey, we can't let these hating bottom feeders ruin the optimistic vibes that this Tesla bot progress video brought to us yesterday. As business owners, Optimus will give us access to increased efficiency and cheap labor. As homeowners, Optimus will give us the ability to only have one house robot rather than a robot for vacuuming, a robot for mowing the lawn, a robot for cleaning the pool, a butler robot. Now you just have one robot. Optimus. And as a civilization, Optimus enables us to go places we've never been before. Musk plans to send hundreds and thousands of Optimus bots to Mars to begin the early stages of settlement there. And the fact that Tesla is headquartered in America and is a public traded company that we can take part in is extremely exciting. So let these bottom feeding haters say that Optimus is fake all day long because FSD12 just got a huge upgrade. Optimus bot, we've now seen amazing progress. So I think we can expect AI day number three coming soon. That's when Optimus is on stage doing new cool things that he's learning or they, whatever pronoun you want to give Optimus. And these little haters in their mom's basements aren't going to be able to call it CGI this time. And you better believe I'm going to do everything in my power to get to that event in Austin and get as much footage as possible for you guys. Good day. Good <laughs> day.